optimistic, you know. And, um, I feel hopeful. Um, I, feel, I feel hopeful in this moment. Um, I just know there's so many people that have come before her to prepare us for this moment. And I just think we have to have some patience. It's going to come down to the wire. So right now we just have to wait the wait out. So this is not the easy part of the night, but we're not giving up. It's not over until it's over. The results are surprising to me, uh, but we know that uh, the night is still young, so we are going to still um, still keep being optimistic, you know, in terms of what's to come. Um, I feel hopeful. Um, I, feel, I feel hopeful in this moment. Um, I just know there's so many people that have come before her to prepare us for this moment, and I just think we have to have some patience. Um, the thing that's been in my mind all day is the faith of a mustard seed and we just got to keep the faith and just stay and hold on to that faith until we slide into victory. Um, and so we're going to just be patient and be hopeful. They have so many different paths and so we're going to, we're just going to keep the faith. They're still counting and we're just going to watch the count. It was going to come down to the wire. So right now we just have to wait the wait out. So this is not the easy part of the night, but we're not giving up. It's not over until it's over. So there's no need to throw in the towel until we get to the point where all the votes are counted and we see what the final 270 number is. Don't give up now. This is when your faith gets tested, right? It's when you can't see the end, but you trust what it will be. So we're still holding out till the end. Everyone has worked hard on this campaign. They've been out there sharing the policies that this candidate stands for. So we will stand strong and wait until it's really over. But right now, there's still a lot of opportunity for anything to happen at any given moment. And we'll take it just like this democracy has done for all these years. We have to live with the results and move forward and make sure that our country and our democracy is sound. I'm a strong believer in God, so I really believe that, you know, he's going to come through and he's going to finally give us what we deserve, which is a black woman who rightfully deserves to be president. I mean, of course, like, I'm nervous. Uh, every time a new poll comes in, it's like, wow. It's like, wow. <laughs> but overall, I think that as of right now, it's not over yet in the race. We still have a long way to go. So uh, it's not over till it's over. So until it says that he is officially the presidential elect, the winner, of the race, I still have hope and I think that she's going to win. You know, she ran a great campaign and she, des she deserves it. We're not leaving because we think it's a done deal. We're leaving because it's late and we have to go to work tomorrow morning.